lower, lower clicks on. So um, this uh, this is how I've been using Bing ads uh, in the last couple of weeks. I kind of stumbled upon this uh, uh, on a webinar on another subject altogether, but it gave me the idea to try it, and it's been working pretty well. Uh, so I'm making a video about it. As you can see, uh, my average uh, click per cost per click has been forty-seven dollars, and uh, I've only been spending about five dollars a day. I'm just I'm still testing it out. Uh, I'm right now I'm working on how to uh, how to uh, set up a liquid self-liquidating funnel by making it convert on the front end. Um, but it is converting quite well. It's actually today I had about uh, eleven clicks. Um, and I got about half of those to uh, opt in. So um, we'll go ahead and take a look at that campaign that I've been running, and then I'll I'll show you a little bit of how I set it up and how you can actually set one up yourself. Um, and this can be done for any uh, any campaign, ClickBank um, offers, JBZoo offers, um, any CPA offer, anything you're running. Um, so uh, here's the here's the campaign that I've been running. Uh, it's a job offer. Um, so what I've been doing is I I've been um, I've been actually sending them to a landing page, uh, which is really simple looking landing page. Um, this really converts well, and uh, I, it was just a, a template that I used. I kind of just customized a little bit to fit my offer, but uh, it's converting quite well. Um, so. Um, there, there's the winning ad that I have that people are are, are liking and are uh, clicking on. As you can see, I kept it simple. Um, and I just it just says everything it is. It kind of pre-qualifies them. It doesn't say anything about being hired. It just says sign up so you can find jobs. So when they click, they're already you know ready to ready to uh, opt in. Um, and as as, the, as far as the keywords that I'm using. Uh, I'm using what it, it local um, keywords, so I'm taking um, um, you know full-time jobs, full-time jobs, and then I'm adding um, regions to them, such as like as you can see uh, Rochester, New York. Um, actually, these ones right here, I'm still still testing out, but I'll I'll show you my week results so far. Um, so as you can see, um, I I paused the ones that uh, they're over 50 cents, uh, and I'm actually I did that because I wanted to uh, I wanted to test the other ones out. Um, but as you can see, uh, I'm getting a lot of uh, I'm getting a lot of um, impressions, and I'm not paying that much. This would probably be about close to to a dollar, uh, and the position's good. So the ones that don't have position, I will come over here. And uh, I'll either go there, click on it, and I'll, I'll change it here to, to um, let's say 0.54. I'll just change it, and I'll see see how that does. And if it gets like if it gets to about here, and it's still um, about five position, I'm going to cancel. I'm going to cut that one, and then try new ones. So, um, but I mainly just wanted to show you. Um, cost per click that I'm getting here. So you can see 33% here for part-time jobs in San Diego. Um, you know, and it allows you to get more eyeballs on your um, on your offers. So uh, it's been working quite well. I'm about ready to run another one. You can see 27 here. Um, I can even increase the bid and so it increases my position. Uh, I can probably do that right now. And we'll do that. So oh, let's see. I'll just move that to. Uh, I, and I only do it like maybe three cents. So we'll say like ninety-one cents. And uh, you know, I might pay, pay like thirty-three cents, and uh, it it'll probably get to a higher position. So um, that's pretty much what I've been doing. Um, let me let me show you real quick how how I how I set that up. So um, you're gonna want to come over to. Max Bounty or any any um, network you're with, uh, you just want to find the just want to find the uh, the affiliate link, and depending on what it looks like, the main thing you want want to make sure is that 
it has the privacy policy here and then there's no pop-up. As you can see that that one popped up as that's mainly why I linked it to a, a website on a landing page. So um, it just depends on um, being um, you can try this it might work but uh, sometimes it doesn't so uh, I'm gonna come down here and I'm going to grab the tracking code and I'm gonna set up a mock uh, a demo um, demo campaign so go to campaign create campaign you always want to do search and content uh, you want to name your campaign um, depending on the region you want to keep it there so it's a United States one so you mainly you just want to keep it on the United States so that you uh, get credit, and then uh, you're gonna want to keep. You can keep that there if you want. It is recommended. I like to go right there, um, just because I, you know, want people in my area. It's a preference thing. And then uh, this is where the affiliate link will go. Um, you can you can use tracking if you have tracking, and uh, I don't have time to show you that, but I do. I did that in a previous video. If you want to go back and check that out. Um, and then you're going to want to grab the custom display, which will be right here on the landing page that you're using. And you want to make sure that uh, this directs to that. Otherwise, Bing will not uh, will not show your your ads. So next comes the title, and this is where you can use some research here. And this is how I find my keywords. So I'll come up here, and I'll say uh, full time jobs. Hiring in, and then uh, you enter the area you're at. So let's say, let's just go New York City because it's right there. So you can also come up here and you can copy those keywords because they're going to show you what uh, people are searching for. So you want to be able to get that in front of people. So now you can kind of just set up an ad like this, and this is actually a really good one because there's not a lot of people um, promoting here. So just come over here and uh, say you know, full time then uh, search your local All right, so there's that. So that's uh, that ad's pretty much set up. Now it's time to uh, set up our keywords. And as you noticed, I copied, I copied the uh, what what was suggested. Now you can also come over here to related searches, and uh, you just copy those as well, and then put those right here, and simply add. And you can do that for as many times as you want, as any areas you can enter. Uh, San Diego, St. Louis, uh, even states, and uh, it'll bring that up. And then uh, you just can go through, and if you don't want to bid uh, $1.41, you can just get rid of it. And then you enter save. And then the last part is uh, you want to turn this off. You, don't, you just want to uh, run it right here in the search networks. And then you're going to click save. And after that, one last step will be to um, find your job offer. You want to come over to keywords, and you're going to adjust the bids. So that's going to be uh, just click all, and then you're going to want to make you're going to want to find the highest bid, which is 42. And Like it just like that there you go and that's that's it you're all set up and uh, next thing you do is just check back in about an hour and a half um, your ad should be running um, Bing is going to uh, review it make sure everything is is okay and then uh, you will either get a notification that your ad hasn't been has been disapproved um, and you can always just contact support and they will help you so 
um, that's that's pretty simple. That's all I've been doing all week, and uh, I've been getting been getting um, lots of I've been getting uh, conversions. So I'm actually going to show you um, my results today. Um, so it's it's a home biz op. As you can see, I got five uh, opt-ins today out of 11, 11 clicks. But that's really good. Um, so I will be scaling that up as soon as I find a an offer um, that will convert on the front end. But right now, I can email these people, and I will make uh, 